Why would it be sacrificed in darkness? To imagine that we should be eradicated, absurd, and ridiculous, we can be changed, modified, or even simply, but never extinguished, we therefore repeat, and we are here. That this is our country too, we shall neither die out, nor shall we be driven away, but we shall go with this people, either as a testimony against them, or as an evidence in their favor throughout their generation. And never remember this, the key word in life for you and me and everybody is the word struggle. Struggle is the key to it all. You understand? If there's no struggle, there's no progress. Men who profess to favor freedom and yet deprecate education are men who want crops without flying around. They want the rain without thunder and lightning. They want the ocean's majestic waves without the awful roar of its mighty waters. The struggle may be a moral one or maybe a physical one or maybe both moral and physical, but it must be a struggle. Power concedes nothing without a demand. It never did and it never will. You find out what a people will submit to and you will find out the exact amount of oppression and wrong that will be imposed upon them. And these will continue until they're restricted by words or blows or both. The limits of tyrants is prescribed by the endurance of those whom they oppress. So then, our people will be held in the north, hundred and front of the south. So long as they submit to these devilish outrages and make no resistance, either moral or physical. Men and women may not get all they pay for in this world, but they sure as hell must pay for all that they get. Thank you very much.